Hello friends. In this video, we are going to review the Tweetcross product for Bluetooth transmitter and receiver. This is one of the best product in market. Whenever you want to make your connect your any device which has no Bluetooth capability, you can use this product and you can easily make that device uh, Bluetooth compatible and you can may play your audio files or video files you can connect with with external speaker so I'll slowly explain you all the features of this device so you can see that it comes in very nice packaging and the build quality of product is very nice we can see so you can see it's very handy and yeah it's a twin. so symbol is there and then you have the two options here as a transmitter mode or receiver mode we will understand what is the difference then you have a power button here this power button usually we can connect uh, we can we have to press for three seconds sometime when we have to connect any bluetooth device then we have this port to charge the device and then definitely aux port to connect to your uh, any device where through aux cable so how it works i'll explain you now i would also like to add here that it comes with uh, two cables so one is aux cable this one is connected to your device and other part will be connected to tv and then definitely a charging cable so you can connect it to your uh, usb port in your tv and then other port in your device so basically why why i purchased this product is because my samsung tv has no bluetooth feature and i want to connect it to jpl uh, speakers which has uh, the bluetooth option and uh, I'll, i will show you how i connected it with my tv and how it works okay before we move and see live demo, I just explain what features it has. So it has two mode, transmitter and receiver. So what is transmitter mode? Transmitter mode is when the device with which you have connected, it plays as a play as a out, audio output. So for in my case, if I connect it to TV, so whatever I play on my TV, audio will be uh, coming from the device speakers which is connected. When it moves to receiving mode, that means it will it will be work as an input device. So there are a few speakers which don't have a Bluetooth capability, but they have aux. So if you connect this device to that speaker, and then you can easily connect your mobile phone, anything to that speaker and play the files. So this is the function of receiving mode and transmitter so for my use i'll keep it in transmitter mode because i want to connect my tv to an external bluetooth speaker okay so to do that we have one aux cable and then I, as i showed you there is a port you can connect here and then this device needs to be charged so what we do we put this cable here and then there's a usb port good thing about this device is it has a 12 hours backup so once it is fully charged it can work without power just for 12 hours even if you want like how i am going to use in tv i just connect it in the backside usb port of my tv panel and then it is work like a normal power so no need to connect or disconnect again and then once you connect to any pair to any bluetooth device no need to do it again and again you just simply switch it on and then it, it will automatically go and connect to that device okay now we see how it it is connected to tv panel so you can see this aux cable from the device i connected to tv output you can see that and for charging i have connected this to my usb port okay and this is my bluetooth jbl speaker how it is uh, going to pair with it i'll show it now so this is uh, already in bluetooth search mode you can see light is blinking what i'll do i'll go to my device the red light means it's charging i'll just simply press it for three seconds and now it's coming to pairing mode you can hear a small sound when it is 
configure so now the bluetooth device is configured let's see and play some audio files and we see if there is any audio video mismatch so as you can see the audio is playing nicely without any uh, voice lag and this is perfectly fine I, I tried multiple videos and audio and I have so far I have no complaint even uh, I tried to use exhaust as power charging point and it, it definitely gave me a 10 hours backup without uh, any charging so I definitely recommend this product